Yo guys, Pulse Worker back again with another video. Okay, so we got a bunch of new leaks on the new Call of Duty. Well, not leaks, but they're hinting towards it being more space-like. Because you can already tell by the cover picture, since they had like three different cover pictures get sent out today, that the guy is holding like a helmet, and it looks like a space helmet, and it has a hose connected to like his back like it was an air supply like if you look at a normal astronaut and they have the hose connected to the helmet to give them oxygen in space because there's no oxygen of course it looks like that but not as bulky and it's like more militarized and so it's like meant to be fighting in space so it looks like it's gonna be more it's gonna be in space for sure and call of duty is having the nuketown playlist thingy like they usually do like every other uh month or so where they have the double weapon xp and then the double xp and then sometimes the double weapon and normal double xp and then sometimes they'll throw in a nuketown playlist like just give it to us like they are now and where you have it till monday but in the end like the normal cutscene where it looks like because normal in Black Ops 1, it was the nuke dropping, blowing it up. In Black Ops 2, I think it was a nuke again, or it was something else that just destroyed the place. And then this time, it's like a, I don't know, it's like a beam of light and it just destroys the place. It's kind of like a modern day nuke, but it's like from space. But this time, there's a spaceship in the background. Like, you, it, it'll be at the end because I actually have the cutscene and it's recorded. And so it, it's like the normal blowing up of the map, but there's a ship in the background, like that covers half the freaking screen. So it's coming out, and you can tell. And you know how it says, "Oh, Nuketown offline." It has the new logo for the new Call of Duty. It's like, um, I don't know. It's kind of like a triangle. Uh, it's kind of hard to explain, but like, if you guys go on Charlie Intel their Twitter page they have it where it's like frozen at what the picture of the spaceship looks like and what the logo that's in the background of it and so it kind of hints or it kind of it that does confirm this is gonna be space like no more it looks like modern day tech like ground based fighting is out the picture like it's gone it's not gonna happen but then I guess Battlefield 5, the new Battlefield, is it, they're going back in time and it's going to be World War 1 maybe, World War 2, like it's going, they're going back in time, so I actually may get that because it's going to be ground based, but because I kind of like Battlefield, but I don't know, I'm for sure probably going to get Call of Duty because, just only because of the Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered, but I guess they had prices for um, the Canadian version, like it's 79 bucks for the standard edition, 90 for something else, and then 109 for the version that includes Call of Duty. But it, Charlie Intel then confirmed that it's 20 bucks less for like each for like the standard edition. So in Canadian dollars, it's 80, but in US, it's 60. So it looks like the like the deluxe edition that comes with um, Modern Warfare Remastered will be like nine, 80 or 90 bucks. So I actually may pick that up and then get the Infinity Ward or Infinity Warfare and sell that because I'm only going to be playing the Call of Duty. And they actually did confirm it's a all it's like a complete call of duty like they have the single players and 10 multiplayer maps confirmed so far that's what i've heard 10 or 10 or 15 multiplayer maps are coming back remastered better graphics like better everything so what do you, what do you guys think about this the nuketown i guess hinting towards a new call of duty like what treyarchs is doing what do you guys think is this what you like is this the call of duty you're gonna get are you gonna get the new quality i love seeing feedback so this has been pulse record see you guys later